Hi kids, it's teacher Carissa. Happy Sunday. I hope you all had a good week and a good Sunday. Um, today you learned from teacher Casey that Jesus is king. Um, that's so special that Jesus is the one true king. Do you know what a king is? What do you think of when you think of a king? Hmm, I have some ideas. Do you think maybe he wears a crown? Or maybe he has a special cape. Or what about a cool scepter? Is that what you think of when you think of a king? Hmm, maybe he might look something like that. Do all kings look like that? That's what I think of when I think of a king sometimes. Where do you think a king lives? Does he live in a house? or maybe in the mountains, or maybe he lives in a castle. Where do you think a king sits? Do you think he sits on the couch or on the ground? Or maybe he sits in a throne like that. Well, a lot of these things are associated with what a king is and who a king is, but Jesus is the one true king. And he doesn't have all those fancy things, I don't think. I don't know, I never met him. But he doesn't need all of those fancy things to be a king because he's just the one true king because he's Jesus. And some of the things that Jesus is are he's humble. Do you know what that means? That means that he puts others before himself and he doesn't think too highly of himself. He's loving because he loves all people. He loves you and me and your family and your friends. He loves everyone. There's not one person that Jesus doesn't love. And he's kind. That means he treats everybody with kindness and he treats everybody with goodness and respect. And he's kind to his friends and to you and to me. And he's selfless. That means he puts others before himself and he um, came to serve us and to love us. Even though he was a king, he's like the true king of kings. Um, he's above everyone. And so I want you not to forget that even though there's a lot of things that you associate with a king, Jesus is the one true king. Even if he doesn't, he might not have all those fancy things and all those materialistic things, he has all of these characteristics and he is the one true king. So can you all say that with me one more time? Say, Jesus is king. Okay, guys. Well, I hope you enjoy this little activity, and I hope you have a good rest of your Sunday and a good week. I'll see you all later. Bye.